Hi guys, today we start a new series for Heart of Iron 4 and we will do Greater Finland and with the Finlandia Focus Tree mod so we get a unique Focus Tree and I asked from few of my subscribers that what do they want to see and the first one was Greater Finland and the other one was Valkis Germany in Führerreich so I believe that one will be next but yeah, let's do Finland first. And so, what do we need to do? Remedy old wounds to get political power, pay stability and war support. Those will help in the wars to come. Then the research, let's go with mechanical engineering and basic machine tools and construction one. Then we build few Military factories, I believe. And set up the army. Mm, take the reservist to another army. Good. And front line towards Sweden. And an offensive line all the way here. Erik lead this army and Marshall shall be Mannerheim. And then on then you will carry some the ports. Well, yeah, you actually need only three, three soldiers, so I will take away three and assign them to the first army. Good. So we start building and producing guns and support equipment. And either submarines or convoys. Let's do submarines. I will need them for the invasion of Denmark. Okay, let's speed up the game. Okay, so remedy old wounds is done. Next up will next one will be debate new tactics and then go to National Defense University to get extra research slot. And now we are going to hire a silent workhorse. We have some options to ask for land from Sweden, Norway and Soviet Union and also Estonia. But we will see how it turns out. Usually Sweden and Norway reject, but for some reason Soviet Union accepts those demands. But then again I am a bit stronger at that point in the game. So, debate new tactics, done, extra research slot, which will also buff our naval doctrine and air doctrine and land doctrines. Good, so now let's get superior firepower. We could also train some guys. Highest priority. Just spam those divisions. We could also edit our template a little bit. Add recon. Yeah, let's do it now. And exercise. Good, we are done here. Now for the elect elections. And let's research mechanical computing. Good, now for this first industry. What else do I need? Well, some extra army experience would be nice, but... We are going to soon invade Sweden, so let's get army offense expert. Hugo Österman. We are building these military factories so slowly, but we don't have time to build up our industry, for we will get a lot of stuff from Sweden. Let's get radio. Okay, stop exercising. We have one cavalry brigade that will be useful for encirclements. Prepare for elections and... Here's the fascist path, Lapua movement re-emerges. 
a uh, little bit minus to base stability, but huge bonus to fascist popularity, and we also get fascist voices, national spirit. Purge the communist. We will become fascist. EGOL becomes the ruling party. Yeah, good. Let's wait a moment. Good. Our new leader. Vilho Annola. Now, now for white card. And should we go to extensive conscription? Actually, we might benefit from this one more. Army regrouping expert. Yeah. Well. Let's get army regrouping expert. Almina. Oh yeah, we can pick traits for Mannerheim organization first. Well, that's only only trait we can assign to him. Unfortunately, he's an old god. I hate that trait, but what can you do? And here's our flag. Pretty cool one. More guns. Good white god is done. Now for... Nation for all Finns, bonuses to our troops, and so on, aggressive stuff. We do have some bad national spirits, but we will get rid of them later. Let's do... do do do. Well, we can do it later. Now let's focus on industry. How about our submarines? Join the anti turn pact. Yes, of course. Um, leader for them and leader for our heavy cruisers. And we are actually Finnish Empire at the moment. Interesting name, but whatever. So the Swedish question. Yeah. Soon we will have war with Sweden. Mechanical computing is done. Let's do anti-air stuff. You will be... Aggressive, they have brought up troops to their border and we can proclaim the Nordic unity once we have captured all of Scandinavia. But with this Finlandia focus tree mod, we can also stabilize just few regions and make them our core states. If we cannot manage to capture Denmark in time, for example, the Sweden refuses. Yeah, I was expecting that. Continue with. Militarization, perhaps. Yeah. And declare war, annex. And go. Inva invitation to faction and volunteers. I will decline both of them, for I don't want to increase the world tension too much. Come on. Try to encircle them. Immediately. Wait a minute. You left this place undefended. Well done, troops. Well done. Ten points to Gryffindor. Uh, what about here? Try to encircle them. Stop them. Create a pocket. Come on. Destroy them. Mm, create a small pocket here. Help with them. More military factories. We could start producing some artillery, even though, though they are not in our template. But the production efficiency will increase. Let's go for the industry stuff. What's going on here? You are taking quite a lot of land. We could try to do huge pockets here. If they have troops here. They have not landed naval invasions. That's good. Now, please, remove this pocket. And there goes most of... Whoa! Almina. I was pocketed. How about that? So how many troops do they have? Six to nine. Almina. Uh, offensive line. Also here. Go, go, go. Come on. Keep creating pockets. Oh, we met some resistance here. Well, we can create a pocket for them. Come on. There's not many of them left here. 
Yeah, Salora Radio. Mutinies in the army. Old patriotic speech. Yeah. This should be over very soon. Good. Now we'll take all states. Thank you. I would also like to boost fascist party popularity in United States to prevent war with them. But that will have to happen later. So front line here towards Norway. Chinese United Front. Oh yeah, we have to wait for a moment before we can annex Norway. Transport ships definitely needed. So now for Norwegian threat. And what do the Norwegians say? They refuse. Well, that's very sad for them. Mm, let's mobilize the Lotta Svart and then get rid of lack of ammunition. And now let's declare war on Norway. And everyone just attack. Go straight to Norway. I mean Oslo. Volunteers from Italy, I don't dare to take them. For I don't want to increase the world tension too much. Good, and that's take care of Norway. How much we have caused generated world tension? Quite a bit actually. 10.3, so we have to wait for a moment. And we actually have naval invasion guy. You will do it from here. But you need better troops for that. So, but yeah, here's the stabilize regions stuff. If we want to do that. At the moment, I don't think we want to. Because we can get this stuff for free if we proclaim Nordic unity. And we also only need Denmark for that. Free factories, deploy units. Oh yeah, here. Oh yeah. We might still have enough time to turn you to fascist country. And which one do we need? Amphibios or, or naval liaison? Yeah, let's take this one. Good. 9.5% of the world tension is increased by us, so we still have to wait. Computing machine is done. Mm, decryption, yeah, why not? Uh, what do we need now? Maybe some land doctrines. Or oh, equipment effort. Proclaim Greater Finland. Gain base stability. Yeah, let's do this. Still no time to justify against Denmark. Oh, it takes 3%. We have to wait until we have generated less than 7% of the world tension. Duplicate. Infantry. Artillery. Artillery. There we go. We want these units. And better fortifications here. Greater Finland is done. We could go for this fortification effort. Uh, let's get the uh, b -b -b land doctrine. Come on. Decrease. World tension decrease. We are running out of time. Still a few months and we and we will justify. Yeah, let's improve our submarines. Future of warfare. Increased attack and defense. Good, let's pick that one. And it's time to justify. So... 6.7, this increases by 3%. 9.8, so they won't get guaranteed. Lovely. Okay, we have enough convoys, I believe. Focus on the submarines. How many do we have? 17. And Denmark, you have... 17. Okay. Soon, Denmark, you will be overrun. Okay, so in the late December. 
I just hope we can beat the Danish Navy. We need just in case Chief of Navy. Well, actually, no. This won't benefit us, us at all. Well, maybe a little bit. Ship designer, no. This really won't help us much. Nothing really that important. Molotov cocktail, equipment effort. China has capitulated. Oh no. Reassert Eastern claims. We have to hurry up. Okay, now is the time. Mm, okay, let's go. Declare war. Please, let this work, let this work. Now I can take all the volunteers I want. For this is my last invasion. Convoy intercepted. Oh yeah, we managed. Great, all of you, half of you go there and help here. Good, 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 good. We are about to beat them. No, don't leave this place guarded. Idiots. No, that should be the end of Denmark. Is it? Come on. Go, go, go. Okay, now take all states and turn. Good. Greater Finland and after that proclaim Nordic unity. All of this becomes our core states. And we are Nordic Empire. And we kept all the all the bonuses. Good. And now we don't even have to stabilize things except Lapland for some reason. I wonder why it didn't go away. Well, anyway, here's unification of the Nordics. Read it if you want to. Now we re uh, prepare for the invasion of Soviet Union. Oh uh, yeah, let's join the Axis. Oh, renaming Lapland. With the region now firmly under our control, we should consider finalizing the integration by renaming the province and any possi possible cities that lie within. Divided in the past but united once more, Myanmar reborn. Gain stability. Of course. Renaming Nord, so this place was renamed now for Nord Nord, 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 whatever. With the region, region now firmly under our control, blah blah blah. We are not having region called Northern Norway within our nation. Let's call it Finnmark. As it was in Crus Crusader Kings, I believe. Good. Everything is going according to my plans, except here. I must have misclicked. Go like this. Are you doing Molotov Rip and Drop Pact? Not yet. Well, that's kind of relief. Although, now that I think about it, it might be beneficial to join Japan so they would help with us, help us with the Soviet Union. I keep that in mind. I might end the episode soon. Yeah, now is a good time to end. Thank you for watching and bye bye.